yeah, so this is a problem. Too many bulky frames and no facials. And this waist bone doesn't work as well. Oh, we're gonna fix that. Don't worry. Let me just delete the model. And then go go to Pumix Editor. And you open your model. Oh, where is it? Now this base pack is by Fried Flakes. I downloaded it for this tutorial on how to fix this. And there. Now go to the bone frame and find the waist bone. Go to bone tab and you might you might wanna move it up to the girl bone or something next to it. It's gonna take a while though. Whoops. I move it up too much. Oh. Now all you want to do is click the upper body and lower body and parent it to the waist bone. Now go to transform view. Whoops. Now you click the waist bone. Try moving it like this. Now it works. Hooray! You might want to save it. Now, cleaning the uh, display frame or something, it's, it's that easy though. Just drag all these unneeded thing here. Now you don't want repeated bones in this. Now you might wanna have a a notepad that contains the name of the bones because uh, it's useful. Now go to the English tab of the display frame and then paste this. Oops, wrong. This is the IK bone. Let me take this. And then delete unneeded groups. Fingers, legs, or just the hair. If you put a hair on the model, it should stay. And then, on the. Save. Now to make sure the model is clean, you might want to do this. Oops. That's too many physics, so. Um. Go to MSK, select all. Oh, I forgot. You, you might want to click this and then go drag it
and then select all that's the hidden vertices hold shift and delete yes then drag it back to the position Now you might want to delete any of these physics. And once you open MMT, it should be looking fine, but uh, let's go first to the morphs and then find... And as you can see, they don't have the English names. That's why they have the no. You might want to name it as this. This. This the. Just name all this. I'm I'm gonna fast forward this so uh it it, it won't take long. Okay, so after you've done all that, you might want to go to the bone and rename it in the English names as well, so it won't be a snow. I'll provide the notepad where I put the English names at the bone, so you, you won't be confused. I'm going to fast forward this as well. After you've done all that, you go to save yeah, and then open it up in MMD. Oops. <laughs> and then hooray. Now the facials are named. Look at that. And the bones are named too. So I hope this helped. Uh, thanks for watching and see you all next time.